we are going to uh, watch a little bit of uh, 40k Space Marine official developer update trailer. This is only about two minutes, so let's see what they got for here for us today. So working on a Warhammer 40,000 license, especially Space Marine 2, is, is an amazing honor, and I'm very excited about it. There are millions of people that love this franchise. And one of the scary things about this franchise is that there are millions of people that love this franchise. Hmm. I can respect that. We didn't just want to create uh, any third-person shooter. We wanted to create a game that embodied the galactic warfare that you, you come to know uh, from this, this franchise. It is a passion piece for all of the people working the Sabre. You know, these are people who've read the novels for years, who've played the games, and so nobody has higher expectations than us. I'm playing physically. I mean, we should have known, right? This is a developer update. This is really all they're, they're talking about here. Um, their passion and trials and tribulations that they run into. We'll probably see more of this as it gets closer to launch, but I'm curious. I don't remember them announcing a uh, release date. It's pretty amazing. Most human beings in this world will never see a space marine. They're, they're the stuff of legends. They're known as the angels of death. His angels. When one appears on the battlefield, it, it's like seeing an angel of God. Well, Titus has uh, you know, oh. been there. I actually didn't know that. Seen more than all the other ultramarines. He's an apex predator. Yeah, everything he does with purpose, everything with intention, everything with extreme power. People who've read the books will have expectations about how space marines fight. And so that's hmm. been our guiding principle behind uh, the gameplay that we created. One of my favorite Dude. parts of uh, the trailer release. It does look so good, though. People gave afterwards. And I saw all this excitement over just a tiny few snippets of gameplay. And I just kept thinking, wait till you see what we got for you. Wait till you see what's next. All right. It was a nice way for people who are hyped about the game to continue getting more. Um, doesn't look like we have any other news. Uh, still no release date or anything, just signups and, and different things like that. Honestly, like if it's anything like the previous game uh, from the bit that I played, I'm in. I'm already in, but it should be a grand old time. Uh, I have wanted to, but never have just done it, made the, uh, the dive in to get into the Warhammer books. Um, that's always been something I've been interested in. I've read through all the Halo books when I was working overnights. I um, I had it on Audible, and that was a fantastic experience. Even as someone who isn't like the biggest of Halo fans, someone who was a casual Halo fan, reading the books and and doing all that was a pretty good pretty good time. And I'm curious if the Warhammer books are are similar in any type of capacity. Um, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to check it out. I think every month I get a free book redemption so i'll probably pick up one of them um i have to scour the internet though and figure out where to start really with <laughs> with the whole warhammer universe i'm assuming it's different chapters if i remember correctly of of space marines and different like units and, and whatnot so you could probably pick up anywhere i don't think there's a just one continuous like continuity like a harry potter or whatever it's just kind of like a bunch of different stories all different authors um, different timelines and different stuff like that too. So I'll have to do some research and figure out which which lines are the best to start on and then pick it up from there. So I don't know. I don't know when I'll do it. I don't know if I'll uh, remember to do it, but Warhammer's always had a, I've always had a fascination with it. And Space Marine is definitely a, a game that I need to revisit in time for Space Marine too. Okay. And then the other one is the Warhammer 40k Dark Tide. Uh, what was it? Rejects will rise. This is the name of the trailer. Just shy of two minutes. The city of Tertium is under attack. My city. A dark tide of chaos is rising. Our best fighters are falling. Time to try new tactics. Interesting. Something different. Something desperate. Models are a little janky. We take you, the outcast, 
and the criminal, the lost and the damned, because you have nothing left to lose. Okay, so these are just like random people. These aren't like official, you know, I don't know. I knew they weren't space marines, but I figured that they would be a little bit more important. I guess they're just new and random. Random people have been changed in some way. So you're the scum we're counting on now. And if it's come to this, then God Emperor help us all. Okay. That was a interesting little look into the lore here. September 13th. Okay, I actually don't know if I knew the official release date. Um, that was actually pretty interesting. I'm going to be honest with you. It's coming out on Game Pass as well. So it seems like just based off of all this, look, they're all chained up and stuff. Uh, actually, are they? No, they're not wearing wrist shackles. I'm sorry. I thought these were like how prisoners wear like the chains around their, their waist and like are shackled um, to them so they can't have too much range of movement. Actually, it may be. They have things around their collars. Let's see. When they're walking in line here. No, they're just part of their outfits. It does look like prisoner rags or something like that. Or like maybe slum rags. But, I mean, we have this character here. Looks like they're all... And we have the big boy over there. Uh, I don't know really what happened. If they were like... Signed up because their city changed with this gas. This Terrigen mist. <laughs> or whatever. Something different. Something desperate. And it looks like they get, you know, different suits of armor or whatever. Kind of like picturing themselves in this hologram. I don't know. I, like, again, I don't know too much about the lore of Warhammer, but I've always been interested. We'll see where it goes. Uh, this was a fun trailer just to kind of whet the appetite and continue the hype cycle that goes along with the Warhammer.